I'm killing you. But unfortunately, I could only afford a wiffle bat, so it's gonna take a while. Carmen! Don't fight it, Kyle. It will only take longer. Just slip into sweet unconsciousness. Okay, kids, listen up. It's story time. So I was talking to my girl earlier today, right? And she was like, I'm on my period, babe. I said, now, honey, if I can drive through mud, I can sure as hell fuck through blood. And uh, she had the audacity, right, to say, now, that's just gross. I said, now, darling, why would a man have a sword if he's scared to get it bloody? And that, my friends, separates the boys from the men. So I have a little car and it keeps saying, you need to rest, you need to rest. I don't need to rest, I'm just a bad driver. Also, I'm in a, a car wash. What the heck? E-girls in cowboy boots. Yeah. Oh, wait. Wait a minute. This my but the yee yee. But I could fucks with the, wait, hold on. This man's a fucking genius. Shit, I, I gotta send, wait. I gotta send a fucking text message. Wait a minute. I got, wh where's my wallet? Why were we not funding this? Wait a minute. But, but. Do you wanna see this rat skull I found? This is in my backyard. Yeah, what little rascal you got back here? You got a kitty cat. No, a rat skull. A, it's dead. Oh, pardon me, I miss her. All right, yeah, there's a little sucker. You know what? I bet he's still cute. <laughs> you don't gotta be kicking, you know? I used to have the rest of the skeleton, but it just disappeared one day. So now all I have is the head, I think Maybe the rat came back from the dead to claim its skeleton or something. It's really rad. No shit, ghost rat. Oh my god. That's cool as hell. Thanks. Got any other dead stuff I could see? Do you want to make out? You would! <laughs> Get a pet velociraptor, you said, Steven. It would be fun, Steven. <laughs> now it's trying to eat me, Steven. What do I do? Is that so funny? Hey. He's gonna eat your whole shirt, babe. They call themselves the Guardians of the Galaxy. And a bunch of a holes. Oh my goodness, we're getting onto the front pasture, the part that you haven't been able to get on. Come on, girls. Come on, girls. Please don't kill me. Don't run me over. Oh, shit. Don't run too much. Be careful, you fucking, you fucking crazy. Y'all motherfuckers nearly trampled me. Hi, ladybird. Welcome. Welcome! Holy shit, y'all are excited about this fucking grass. There's so much of it. You're in a new place and there's new grass. Oh my goodness. Y'all nearly all murdered me. I've been picked on three times today. Oh, because of my trousers. What's wrong with your trousers? Look at the fucking size of... I can't talk right now. I'm doing comedy. You ain't even country for real. Like, you ain't even country for real. 
For real. For real. I could take you for a ride on my big green tractor. We can go slow or we can go faster down through the woods and out to the pasture. As long as I'm with you, it really don't matter. Bitch, if that's not country, then I don't know what is. Because I can really take you for a ride on my big green tractor. Really? Yeah. Why not? Oh my god. What? Dude, what if he's talking about his Pina Wiener? I could take you for a ride on my big green track. Is that what he really That means? clever SLB. Pull me. Pull me. Always hope. And it endures through every circumstance. And the Bible says these three remain, faith, hope, and love. But the greatest of these is love. <laughs> Clones or not. <laughs> Okay, let's wash this tail. Obviously, it's very dirty, very dry, very tangly. At this point, do not, and I repeat, do not take a brush to the hair. You're first going to wet it. Then I use a tangling spray. You don't have to, but I liked it. Then, still without brushing, you're going to add shampoo. You can use any shampoo, but I like Cowboy Magic. You're going to lather it all the way up to the tailbone. Rinse. Next, add conditioner. Again, any conditioner is fine. I like Cowboy Magic. And again, lather it once more all the way to the tailbone. You can let it sit for a little bit if you'd like. Then rinse it again. Let the tail dry and then add Cowboy Magic to Tangler and Shine. This stuff is pure magic. Use a generous amount with this. And then and only then you may brush his tail. Put it in a loose braid with a large rubber band at the bottom and repeat once a week. Okay, you've seen how to get a white horse white. Now it's gonna be how to get a black horse to stay black. We're gonna rinse her off first, rinsing her whole body. Right now I'm getting all of the dirt off. This shampoo is everything. Apply the shampoo everywhere. You cannot dilute this or it will not work properly. Literally apply it everywhere. Wash everything with this. Now it has to sit on them for five to 10 minutes. Yes, it will stain your hands. Rinse them off thoroughly until the water runs clear. Now we're gonna squeegee her off real good. All clean. Spray with some type of spray that moisturizes their coat, but make sure it won't bleach them. Do not put them in the sun wet. They can bake in the sun and it's not good for them. When they go outside, invest in a nice UV protectant sheet. This will help her from fading. Hope this helps. Your car, what do you do for a living? Is that Daniel Matt? Yeah, no, Daniel Matt. Stop. <laughs> I am. What, what do you do? She's a stripper. A stripper? Really? <laughs> what do you do? Sell jewelry. Sell jewelry. Okay, that's awesome. Hey, what do you do for a living? Oh shit, bro, this is just a car rental. Oh. <laughs> Already, you're honest though. You're yeah, honest. Yeah. No, hey, shit. Uh, wait, are you? Are you Daniel, right? Daniel, yeah, oh, cool. Daniel Mac. What's up, bro? <laughs> Thank you, man. I appreciate it. Well, sick car. What do you do for a living? Yo, 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 you're the car guy, right? Yeah, you seen it? What's up? What do you do? Um, we do real estate. We sell a Dogecoin. Really? Yeah. Okay. Oh! Oh, boy. Hell yeah. Oh, man. all the way here that's a good two or three blocks please tell me you won't follow you were i give you one million dollars in cash but only 30 minutes to spend it 
four words. Date a barrel racer. I can fucking see it now. You walk in, you're like, baby, baby, Mr. Beast just gave us a million dollars. We have to spend it in 30. What the fuck do you mean it's gone? You spent a million. Like, that went into my account five minutes ago. What the fuck did you buy? Right at that moment, you walk outside, there's a 216 foot bloomers trailer. You're like, whose fucking trailer is that? That's bigger than our fucking. Why do you need that? You have two fucking horses. And then Peter Bowler, look at Is that your fucking Peter? You drive a 96 Honda Civic, okay? You fucking curb everything. What's gonna happen when you're driving that thing around? You think you can drive a Peterbilt? What else did you buy? A diamond studded breast collar. You know how fucking heavy that is? You're gonna be doing like 45 second barrel runs, which is an improvement over your 63 second barrel runs. You should have bought some fucking lessons with that million dollars. X that horse girls. Don't want you to know. Part one. Horses are like kids. See, the thing that people don't understand is a lot of these buckle bunny radio girls, and a lot of these, well, just girls in general, because just odd girls do it too, English, everybody does it. They make the horse look harder to handle than it really is. I mean, I understand a lot of horses have problems and a lot of horses are hard to handle, but a good rider, their whole purpose is to make the horse look like it's easy to ride. And a lot of girls do this for a while, they make it look really hard to ride just to make themselves look better. Um, but a, a big fact that they don't want you to know is it's, it's really not that bad. Um, if you take the time and put in the groundwork and do everything that you're supposed to do, you get a calm, settled horse. Another one is the horse's rear. I mean, everybody talks about how dangerous a horse's rear is, bro. Like, it's not that bad. You just have to train your horse. Now, obviously, a mare is a little different, but still, a big misconception is how dangerous horses are. They're not.